The UN's World Health Organization is on the hunt for anyone who's had contact with a man who died of Ebola in Nigeria. Two teams of experts in epidemics are being dispatched after Patrick Sawyer died. The consultant for the Liberian Finance Ministry collapsed on arrival at the Nigerian capital. We understand that in this part of the world, the, the, the borders are very, very porous, so it's quite easy for people to, to cross from one country into another without detection, without using uh, regular border crossings. So you know, we, we again, we see the most effective uh, response to uh, outbreaks such as this is to undertake you know, clinical uh, you know, testing, laboratory testing, clinical management, con contact tracing is, is, is essential. In Lagos, the Nigerian government shut down and quarantined the hospital where Sawyer died. Authorities are also monitoring 59 people who were in contact with him. Both the states and the federal governments are, are up in arms to ensure that the virus does not escape and that no Nigerian is infected with this virus. It's the first recorded case of Ebola in Nigeria, one of Africa's most densely populated countries. The government's concerned as the disease is highly contagious, with symptoms including vomiting and internal and external bleeding. It can kill up to 90% of people who catch it.